This screencast is a simple introduction to Pearnote. Here I've got a new Pearnote document. I'll just record audio for now to make this simple. So let's press record and get started. I need something to take notes on, so I'll take this opportunity to talk about what Pearnote records in addition to audio and video. For instance, right now as I'm typing this, Pearnote is recording timestamps for each and every keystroke so it knows when they happened. We'll see how this works in just a second. You can add slides to your pair notes as well, including Keynote, PowerPoint, and PDF files. Pairnote will then record when you change the slides so that you always show the correct slide during playback. Now I'll stop the recording so we can play it back. During the playback, the characters will be highlighted when they were typed, like this. I need something to take notes on, so I'll take this opportunity to talk about what Pairnote records in addition to audio and video. For instance, right now as I'm typing this, Pearnote is recording timestamps for each and every keystroke so it knows when they happened. We'll see how this works in just a second. You can add slides to your pair notes as well, including Keynote, PowerPoint, and PDF files. Pearnote will then record when you change the slides so that you always show the correct slide during playback. Now I'll stop the recording so we can... You can also navigate around the recording by simply clicking on the text. When I click on the text, the playback will jump to 10 seconds before that letter was typed, like this. So we can play it back. Pair notes as well, including Keynote, PowerPoint, and PDF files. Pair note will then record when you change the slides so that you always show the correct slide during playback. Now I'll stop the recording so we can... It may be hard to see how useful this is without a longer document, so I'm going to open one. I'll use Pair Note's search feature to find the note I'm looking for. Search brings up my most recent notes. The note I'm looking for was taken at a meeting with Jen. That's the one I want. I hit enter to open the note. This note is from a design meeting. I'm trying to remember what we decided to do about the design. I see here that we decided to use Lucidogrand font and a landscape layout, but I don't see what colors we decided to use. I guess I missed that writing that down. I'll listen to the recording to find that information. First, I'll press play to play the recording. Then I'll click on the text document to, in the place I want to jump to. So to make sure we're on the same page, we're going to use Lucidogrand for the font, a landscape layout, and an orange-blue color scheme, right? Uh, yeah, sounds good to me. Ah, orange and blue. I may have missed writing it down, but Paranote makes it easy to find the missing information. As you can see, Pearnote makes your notes much more useful and ensures that you never miss a thing. Pearnote has several other features as well, so be sure to download it and give it a try to check them out.